If we say that intelligent life has come into existence on this planet by the process of evolution to the point where I'm able to talk to you on this video that goes out over the internet into your homes. For this to take place within this great universe then we have to say one thing and that is that there was always from the beginning of time the potential for these things to take place. The potential for intelligent life and the wonders of modern electronics with the potential for this video and your ability to view it must have existed from the very beginning of space and time. The complexity and diversity of life could not have come into existence if the potential had not been part of the nature of the universe. And it is also logical that we should be able to explain this by physics as a physical process. There is one physical process that could explain this and that is if the universe is based on a universal process of spherical symmetry forming and breaking relative to the atoms of the periodic table. Such a process would naturally form entropy or disorganization with the potential for ever greater symmetry formation that we see in the diversity of life and in modern electronics. The prime example of this is photon energy cascading down from the Sun forming greater degrees of freedom for entropy or disorganization and also greater degrees of freedom for the complexity and diversity of plant life. Another example is flowing water. We have hydrogen bonds breaking and forming with the exchange of photon energy relative to the environment that the water is flowing in. In this theory this represents the future unfolding photon by photon within the water. Just a change in environmental temperature can cause the atoms to bond together with the process forming the uncertainty needed for infinite snowflake diversity. Each photon oscillation or vibration only occurs once but the process of energy exchange is continuously forming the ever-changing world of our everyday life or in other words it is forming what we see and feel as a passage or continuum of time. We have an infinite number of line symmetries within a sphere that in this theory represents an infinite number of timelines for potential future possibilities and opportunities. The law of the conservation of energy falls out of this theory because the future is based on the past as a process of photon energy exchange. Therefore energy is never destroyed or created but only ever changes form. Such a theory can also explain why we seem to have such low entropy or high organization at the beginning of time or what has been called the Big Bang. It is because the further we look back in time the less photon oscillations will have occurred therefore the less potential there was for disorganization and the greater the symmetry. It is out of this symmetry that the broken imperfect symmetry of life was formed. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and share. It will help the promotion of this theory.